Today at Customized Creations, we're going to review some custom machine work and coatings we have applied to a Glock 19 Gen 4 model. Right off the bat, you're going to see the KG Gun Coat Flat Dark Earth on the frame. We also use a special mix of KG Gun Coat for the stealth black color on the slide in the barrel. KG Gun Coat is a leader in the firearms industry. Its coatings are military spec rated and extremely durable and corrosion resistant. You can check out more information on our website at customizedcreations.com. Next you'll notice the custom mounted Burris Fast Fire 3 that's mounted directly to the slide with no frame plate. We machine these directly to the slide for a super accurate, tight fit and repeatability. This allows us to lower the sight of the Fast Fire 3 closer to the bore axis. It also allows us to maintain the iron sights as backups. The iron sights in this case are suppressor style night sights. Further, you'll notice the custom slide machining. This is our extreme lightning package and consists of porting of the slide, the sides of the slide, and engraving removals. We also round out the front nose to be similar to the Glock 26 for carry concealment purposes. The engravings are removed on the sides. As you can see, it's nice and flat. The big difference between what we do and what I've seen others do in the industry is most of them do not remove the engravings on the side. Most of them leave the engravings on the side and cut right through them and leave half of an engraving on there. I don't think that looks good. I think it needs to be a nice, clean, smooth surface. It takes a little extra time to do that, but I take a little more pride and quality in our work, and I like to think that it shows. The gun also has our action work done to it, which reduces the trigger pull to a nice three and a half pounds. It's nice and crisp. It also reduces the reset and smooths out the trigger immensely. Finally, you'll see the crimson and trace laser on the front of the gun there. It's a nice little feature. Our customer wanted to add that to the gun. Kind of like a third backup for your sights. Uh, it's a nice little feature, not too expensive. Uh, and I think it actually rounds out the gun here pretty nicely. Next, we're going to be doing some shooting sessions with this gun. So stay tuned and check out the rest of the video. Today we're going to be reviewing the Glock 19 Gen 4 model. We did a lot of machine work on this. We mounted a Burris Fast Fire dot on it. We also put suppressor sights. We ported the barrel. The slide's got a lot of lightning done to the front of it. It's got a KG Gun Coat Flat Dark Earth and a special Stealth Black, we call it, mixture of uh, black for the slide and barrel. It's got our action work done to it. A Crimson Trace laser as well. This is one of the latest tactical models that you can get that we'll be offering soon. This is some double tap 147 grain plus P plus ammunition. As you can see, really nice and accurate. Very fun gun to shoot with that Crimson Trace laser. And I'm not seeing the laser on here. Okay, well, we got the uh, fast fire dot there. All in all, this is a great gun. We're gonna have these set up in packages with machine work, the coatings, the red dots, the iron sights, porting, different types of porting on the sides, the lightning, engravings. 
you name it. We're going to have it all pretty soon. We can either sell you a gun that's completely done and ready to go, or we're going to be able to offer these as packages that you can send your gun in, and it doesn't necessarily have to be a Glock. It can be an MNP, XD, it could be a SIG. We're going to offer this with everything as far as uh, makes and models go. The red dots, we have already mounted those on SIGs, Glocks, M&Ps, XDs, uh, Smith & Wessons, some of the Sigmas, and a lot of other models as well. So stay tuned for those. Look for some other videos. And as soon as we get some more 9mm in, we're going to start shooting the heck out of these guns and give them some torture tests.